Switch, son, mad, dad, Noah, Kuhn, dedication. We're here with Atari 50. And now what I want to focus on today, this is a fan, a absolutely fantastic package. Um, it's a museum, it's a ton of games, etc. But what I want to focus on is the Jeff Minter games that are included. One of which is Akar. I still can't pronounce it. Um, and now that uh, Jeff Minter um, went back and remastered this, but this is the original prototype. So let's give the prototype a go. Let's go to our controls here. Fire weapon, power blaster, zoom. Okay, that's all we're going to need to know. Resume. No, not level two. <laughs> no, I don't want to start at level two. That's okay. And so just like the remake, what you're trying to do is um, keep these guys from uh, breaking into your little uh, shield base on the bottom. And so you can shoot them up here. But if they go down, if they go downstairs, like it says there, they're boom. You gotta zoom down here and make sure they don't destroy your shield. And boom up. As they just did to me. I think they have like a power bomb or something. Anyways, um, I highly recommend the remake of this. Um, the the, the controls are the control the controls in this um, Atari collection are a bit finicky. Um, they really um, Minter really um did a great job of uh, of remaking uh, just a lost game. Uh, but at the same time, it is, um, it's fascinating to go back and see how it's, it's basically the exact same game. It's just, the controls are, the you know, controls are a bit wonky, and, um, <laughs> and of course the, uh, it doesn't have all the insane, I mean, it's, it's still, for the time, it's just pretty wild colors, but, um, Nowadays, Jeff Minter's games are absolutely bonkers of visuals. Game over. Okay. Oh, any of your high score? Well, thank you for, um, no. PSA. Sure, PSA. Let's do that. Okay. Let's get out of here. And let's go to the next. It just, I mean, this is just the, um, this is just the game screen. Ah, uh, here we go, Tempest. But, um, if you're in the museum, it just has fantastic um, amazing absolutely amazing um, concept art I mean videos people I mean they're talking about how they made it um, it's just fantastic and the little details like the the, the side cabinet art which is which is accurate I had a when I was growing up, my, my love for Minter started when I was a kid. My cousin um, had an 
actual Tempest Arcade Machine <laughs> in his basement. How he, how he, how he came across that, I do not remember. But at the time, I mean, that was just... Someone with an arcade machine at home was just... Mind-blowing. I mean, you couldn't, you couldn't even imagine. I mean, now, now, it, now it is. Heck. But, um, yeah. My cousin had a Tempest machine. And so, I would go over there. And, um, play some Tempest. And, um... Play a lot of Tempest. And anyways... It was just so, it's, it was, it's, it was so unlike, I'm really botching it. It was so unlike every other game at the time. Um, I mean, it, it just, Jeff Minter, just a, an absolute genius ahead of his time. Now, let's see, I... I believe there's just one more Jeff Minter game in the collection, but as you can see, the collection is insane. They've got, um, this is cool. They finished the Sword Quest series. Um, which, um, there was this big prize, you know, if you get all, buy all the, buy all four of the Sword Quest games, and you, um, you know, if you're the first person to beat it, you get a prize. But um, they never released the fourth game. <laughs> um, and I haven't, you know. I haven't even played a lot of these games, but here we go. Tempest 2000. This is a fantastic game. This is... Now this... Hang on, let me, let me get my controls here. Jump is X. Okay, that was my problem. Jump is X. Okay. Okay. Brilliant addition to the collection. They, they've just... I can't recommend this highly enough. Um, and I've been just going through the museum. Um, looking at all the documents, watching the videos. And so I'm not even near, um, you know, where they got to the gym and stuff. Um, this is the first time actually I've played, um, Tempest 2000 on here. But, um, what's up, must my jump on? <laughs> well, the point isn't to show off. The point is to, sh is to show off Minter's genius. And... Yeah, and they do a great job of it, and they do they do a great job of just um, it, it's it's real it's real honest. I mean, they talk about you know like they talk about what really went on behind the scenes of Atari in a real frank manner, which is. I've just, I've never seen a collection like this before in my life. It's, uh, got you. <laughs> they got me. How many lives do I have? I died, like, a dozen times. I'm playing on, like, Zen mode. Um, and of course, he's, he's since updated, uh, Tem Tempest again, you know, to, add, to make it completely wacky. Um, 
but... <laughs> I gotta figure out that jump button again. I thought it was X. But, um... For the time being, I mean, just just as today, if, if you were to buy, um... Aka Arn on the Xbox... Um... In fact, let's go back. Let's go. Let's go to home, and let's go just check out Akar, 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 Akar. Jeff, can you can you give us a hint as to how you pronounce this? And so here we go. A bullets, B bombs. Okay. What did I? What did I choose? Did I choose something crazy. Game over. <laughs> okay, let's give them a look back. But here you can see. Um. Am I hitting A? Okay. Th yeah. This is the thing. This is what you want to do. You want to set up bombs that create chain reactions to keep all these guys from getting anywhere near. When a bomb hits a guy, it creates a chain reaction. And it keeps them from going to your bottom level. But you can see. Some of the enemies that you can see are affected by the bombs. Um, Got it. Shoot the cursor with the cursor. And uh, oh. both of cool. these guys and see so sets up a chain reaction. The controls are just better. He, I mean, he just did a fantastic job. This is just a love letter to. Jeff Minter. And, um. He, um. He made a good, like. He must have made, um. He made, like, six or seven iOS games. But they're all delisted. They're all delisted. And I have kept an iPad 3. All these years, I've changed the battery because, of course, the battery uh, died. But I've kept that iPad 3 in order to keep those Jedimetry games. Because, in my opinion, I wouldn't say they're necessarily my favorite games, but. No one does what he does. No one. That, I mean, there just there just aren't any other games like 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 what Mentor does. Yeah. So, anyways, I think we took a good look at it. But as you can see, like it's um, what's the uh, what's the control for going down? But it, <clears throat> same concept, same concept. And actually, I'm doing fairly well here by not letting. Now these are guys that you can't. Um, these guys are not affected by bombs, so you gotta shoot them. I can't, 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 I
But as you can see, the controls are a lot better, and um, I haven't had to go downstairs yet. As you can see, I've been... I haven't been, um, prudent with my shooting. But... Let's drop a bomb to start a chain. Let's do it. This is also, this is also, and, and I'll, and I'll quit, I'll quit blowing smoke out of uh, Jeff Minter's, um, behind here soon, but, um, as technology increases, he revisits past games, um, to refine them, um, make them more graphically insane, if you will, um, which is another thing that, um, that I think he does fantastic. I mean, yeah, gosh, if you have a lot of bullets left though, it's... anyway. I think that's enough for Aka R and the Jeff Minter um, dedication, but I'll probably do several of these in the future because to me, like I said, not necessarily my favorite games, but Nothing touches them. Nothing touches them. So. Switch Sun Mad Dad. No Akun Dedication. See you soon, buddy. I love you. Ooh, yeah. Jeff Minter, down that aisle. Yeah, I got it. I'll, I'll get, I'll, I promise I'll try to get the um, the soundboard next time. Switch son, mad dad, over and out.